guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to make the slip knot and the chain. This is the most important thing to learn when you wanted to start learning how to crochet. So like you, uh, I also started by learning how to crochet by videos or reading the pattern and looking at the pictograms. But the thing that can really help you is like if you know somebody who knows how to crochet, you can ask them and you can ask them how to teach you. Or of course, look at this video and we just learn to do uh, we just learn how to do the basic. I'll make the video slow for you guys so you can really follow the step by step procedure on how to make the slip knot and the chain. And if you still don't get it, just don't hesitate to just go back to the video or to that part where I make the slip knot and the chain. And I hope guys that you will learn from me and let's get started. The first thing that I'm going to show you is how to make the slip knot. The things that you are going to need is a yarn and your crochet hook. This yarn, I can use the 8mm crochet hook. Okay, so let's get started with uh, making the slip knot. So what you have to do is you have to get the end of the yarn and then put them together like this. There. You just have to twist it a bit. Put your finger, your index finger and your thumb inside this circle. And then you get the smaller yarn here in the middle looks like that and then what you have to do is hold this together again and then pull this through and that is it you got your first slip knot okay let's do it again grab this end and then grab the other yarn Twist it a bit, like that, and then you have to get the smaller part of the yarn, it will look like this, and then just pull this together like that. Then you already have the slip knot. Okay, let's do it again. Grab this, this end of the yarn and the other part like this. Twist it a bit here. And then after twisting it, just get the other end of this yarn. And just pull the like this. And you have your slip knot. And that is where you're actually going to put your hook. Okay. So repeat this like a lot of times until you get it. And after that, I'm going to show you how to make the chain stitch. So now let's start the chain stitch. So the slip knot that we just made is here. All you have to do is insert your hook inside the circle here in the middle then just pull it like that until you just feel like you know it's easy to go um, around it what you can also do is put your um, the yarn above your index finger and use your pinky and your ring finger to hold it here like that and then your thumb and your middle finger hold it here so you're actually looking like this like that. okay so making the chain stitch you have to turn your hook at the back and then get this there get the hook and then pull through in the middle like that you can move your thumb and your middle finger a little above it on the chain. Then you can do it again like this. 
then turn it around like this again. This is your second chain. And then another one. Just like this. Then you do another one. Turn it around and then like this. Like that. <laughs> Just turn it around again and then just pull it in the middle. So this is how you make the chain stitch. Just make the chain stitch um, whatever numbers you like just to practice until you, f uh, until you feel comfortable with it. So yeah, that's it. <laughs> So guys, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video and learned something from me today, please don't forget to subscribe, like, follow, or anything under the sun. Share it with friends. And I'll see you next time. Thank you and bye-bye.